I would describe my community as a community on the rise. There's a lot of solidarity here. We all know each other. We're bringing in like 2,385 units of housing. It'll be an 80 million dollar school. This was the best project that we've ever negotiated. We want schools, we want parks, we want hospitals, low-income housing. Walmart? No, not Walmart. You bring in Walmart, every study tells us for every two low-paying jobs you get, you lose three. What Walmart does is destroys communities. As small as our community may be, we do have an economy. The grocery store around the corner, a really great guy, know his family. Um, if he can do anything to help the community, always willing to do it. We give special attention to our customer. I mean, our customer comes, they know us first. Since I know I have a customer since 1984. Yeah, I do handiwork for the people. Sometimes they don't know how to put on a faucet or they want to connect a, a speedy line or they want to fix a toilet bowl that's clogged. You know, they give us a call, we go to their house and take care of it. All day long we are here like a family, so I mean, they they love the business, they love me, and I love them. Tengo tres hijos, sí, mi esposa, sí, vivo de todo, de todo depende, mi familia. If a woman was to come here to this neighborhood in East New York, I wouldn't know what to do. Pasaría algo así, me vería en peligro para pagar mi renta. You're killing an economy to bring in what? If you really want to work with the community and putting something in that's viable and as valuable, then let's have a sit down discussion of what makes sense. Related, you should come around my community, speak to, to the community, to the people that live here. Don't be related to Walmart. Don't be related to Walmart. Don't be related to Walmart. Don't be related to Walmart.